Hey everybody, yes, I'm back from another video and it's Saturday and yeah, I'm sorry I didn't do this yesterday. I know I said I was going to do an update video yesterday, but I was really busy and obviously I didn't want to just sort of rush something, like, because you don't want me just sort of talking even faster and then not being able to edit and you get to see shit Roland and not edited. That sounds really bad. But yes, I just wanted to come and say hi and see how you all are. And oh my god, I'm so happy. Like seriously, my ID eventually came. I was so like, came a couple days ago and I was like, Grandad, please tell me that's what I think it is. And I took took the letter off him, opened it up, I was like, oh my god, it's my ID. Because obviously now I can go clubbing when I go to London next week. So, ugh. So that's amazing. I got my ID. So we're going to go clubbing. Oh my god, I can't, like seriously guys, I cannot wait to meet you. I'm like, oh my god. But I've got a couple stories to tell, like seriously, some people at work are so stupid, right? I was on the till, like, and I was doing my thing, scanning items, and this woman came along, she had like three bottles of wine. And she said to me, she goes, if I buy six of them, do I get any offers? And I said to her, I don't know about this wine, but there may be some offers on other wine. Because obviously I don't know if we've got offers on like all of our wines, because I'm not that clever. And she's like, but if I buy six of them, do I get any money off? I was like... I don't know. Go and go look. I, I don't know what, what ones are in office. So if you go look at the things, some of them we offer, some of them won't. She goes, but you don't understand what I mean. If I buy six bottles of wine, do I get money off? I was like, excuse me. I know what you mean. Go and look on the offers. But Tesco's does six bottles for some money. This is Morrison's. This isn't Tesco's. What are you, oh my God. Oh my God. Seriously, bitch. Go to a different fucking supermarket if you don't like our deals. And this she kept telling me, she kept telling me over and over again, you don't understand what I'm saying. I want to know if there's six bottles on offer. Go look. I don't know, okay? You stupid woman. Go and look. Seriously, oh my god. Oh my god. What? What? And then, right, I'm like, I know this is, I don't want to say I'm laughing about this, but I mean, this was like, it was just a bit kind of like, oh my god, what the hell do I do? This woman came to my table, right, and she looked a bit, she looked like she hadn't been sleeping very well, because you could see she had bags on her eyes and all this kind of stuff. And then one of my supervisors came across, and she said, I was talking to her, and then, um, she looked, and she goes, hi, because she knew the person, she goes, hi, and she looked, and she goes, I haven't told you have I yet, and she was like, what, my husband left me, and I was like, Awkward. And then she just started crying. I mean, she was just bawling her eyes out in the tear, like on my tail. I was like, what do I do? Oh my God, um, are you, what, 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 I don't know what, what, what was I meant to do in that situation? This woman is just in tears on my tail about how her husband's just left her. Like, like what, what was I meant to do? But the thing that annoys me is why would you talk about it in, in the middle of the supermarket if you knew you were just gonna break down? Like, sit, why, in the middle of, like when, it's just like, I know you may be upset, darling, your white husband left you, but like, in the middle of a supermarket. And then there was this woman, right? <laughs> Seriously, I get all the rude people as well. Like, she was putting her, putting her stuff on the till, and I was already serving someone, and the till behind me was empty. And I said to her, um, do you want to go to the till behind me? Because obviously, there's no one's there. She goes, why are you trying to get rid of me? I like to put my stuff up first before I start getting served, thank you. I was like... All right, seriously, can't, like, seriously, what? Don't have a go, I'm trying to, like, help you here, and you're, like, s s shouting at me, it's like, seriously, oh my god, just die. And there's another guy who comes in all the time, and he always, like, sort of looks at me really creepily, like, um, and he comes in, right, and he's called, well, we, I refer to him as the gay chicken man, and it's a long story, so I can't, I'm not gonna get into that, and he comes in, right, and he shaves his legs, right, and he wears these, like, pink, freely, I mean, they're, they're like, they're literally about that long, short, so he comes in. And he wears his like green top and his sort of like belly hangs out the side and he's like, com like completely hairy and all over. And he's just, what, and he's got like a handbag and he has like a purse and he's like, it's like, and he's so creepy, like he looks at you and he sort of stares at you like this. And it's really creepy, like it really, like I should, I know it's mean to laugh at people, but it's really creepy. And like, there was one time that like, he came in, right, and there were three guys until it was me and two people, and two people in front of me. And he looked at me, looked at the guy in front, looked at the guy in front of him, and then went, went oh, three boys, I can see you all later. I was like, oh my God, get me off this till. This is just scary. I'm dribbling. Ew. No, but it's so disgusting. <laughs> yeah, I'm drawing over him. No, but like, it's so disgusting, like seriously, like, why do I get all this gay people? Three boys, I'll see you all later. Like, really? Ew. I don't think people give us enough credit, really. Like, till workers, you know. We get, a lot of people are like, oh, it's such an easy job, blah, blah, blah. Bitch, you do it for like a month, and you tell me that, like, it's easy. Like, oh my god, like, you've got to deal with so many people. And so you, so many times, you just want to kill, you want to just strangle them so much that their eyes pop out. Like, seriously, just like, oh my god. Just, no. <sighs> now that was a bit of a rant. I need to get that off my chest because it was sort of boiling inside of me. I was like, I had to tell someone about this stuff. And I thought, YouTube! I can just see mass unsubscriptions now.
So yeah, and also I just want to say, if you want to like share your comments on like if you've had any scary experiences at work or things that are like really awkward and you're like, oh my god, what the hell do I do? Um, comment down below and you know, you can sort of tell me, or you can do a video response if you really want to, you know. So I will see you uh, probably on Wednesday because obviously that's when I do my other video. So yes, I will see you on Wednesday and yeah. Ungasha!